What's going on, everybody? Doc here, Average Cover Guys, back again. Escape action. Let's get to it. So, we um, we did some stuff, and then we took a break, <laughs> and we did some stuff on some other accounts. <laughs> we have been jam-packed here with different events going on. So, we're jumping in back to our escape series. I'm going to head to Woods here today because I figure we should probably open up Mr. Ref. I also need to go ahead and drop gratitude down. And if we can, see if we can find the Sturmy boy and uh, get a kill here. We did not end up doing Hustle on this account, which I wish I would have because I actually had quite a few uh, of the um, Locate and Neutralize bosses tasks. So that would have been really good to do. Just didn't really line up. Wanted to make sure to get that done on our main account. Uh, pretty, pretty fun event. And uh, so we're spreading the love across these different accounts. But uh, easy money part one here. We've got the easier version to go knock out. I think we can unlock ref and we'll see what we can get. Um, again, I don't have arena. I won't be linked to that, but we can see what we can get in terms of daily quests as well as just work through his quest chain, I think could be pretty interesting. Um, so we'll try to do that. So to woods we go today. Interestingly enough, I have an elimination for using VPO, the Vepper Hunter, which is a personal fan favorite of mine and for a weekly and for a daily so we're gonna see if we can get some dual progress on this and we'll see if we can get our first weekly done uh because it's only 35 scavs and we'll get about a third of that here with our daily if we can get that knocked out so over to woods we go all right here we go And find some scavs here pretty quick which isn't bad we also are close to being able to drop our items down so we have gratitude that we need to try to do we'll take that down just a notch Guy was moving. There's one scavy. I think I'm going to try to go get gratitude down. It's always a dicey plant in the middle of the day, but Let's see what we can do. So we'll check it. That could be Sturman. That wasn't an SVD, but it could have been one of the guards with a hunter, actually. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take that. That's pretty dope. Trihawk, nice. Jailbreak. Thief. Solid, solid. We got any good ammos over here? EP. Not bad, not bad. All right, there is a world in which that was the boss, so. fog here I will say it has been really nice the raids that don't have fog have been fantastic I 
I am a big fan of that change. I just go for this. Hopefully don't die in the process. I don't have any of these stashed. Dope. Nice. Alright. Let's see if Sturman's here. A little chocolatey bar. He was there. <laughs> God dang it. BCP FMJ just ain't doing it. <laughs> he hit that one scam so many times. Dude, <laughs> so many times. Oh my God. Oh, we couldn't get the headshot is really what we needed. That's okay. We got gratitude done. It was really nice. I thought, I thought there was a chance the boy was there. All right, got rekitted here really quickly. We did get that task done, so that is pretty nice. Mr. Ragman here will get the gratitude complete. Get some door kicker boonie hats. That's my favorite part. We do open up a few other things here, so we got some more to do. Com contact twos, six Bs, gazelle armors. We got to drop those in. We got sales night, which is going to be uh, obviously surviving and extracting. And uh, we got some more to do over there on Interchange. I still need this one bronze lion, so hopefully we can find that. We got a little bit. We need to find the design clothes book, so more that we could go do over there on Interchange as we move forward. But I'm going to head back in. I'm going to try to uh, go get the poster and get some scabs. See you in the raid. Okay. Kind of the opposite area that we want to be, but I should be bringing cash with me. That's, that's silly, too. Give a listen for Sturman. I'd love, I would have loved that I actually been able to get the kill on him. If we could have killed that guard, we would have been in a good position that last raid. Alright, let's see what we got in here. up again I think we gotta go for him oh 
Hold up. Whoa. I did not know that could spawn. Look at... I really did not know that could spawn. Like that. I think I'm gonna forego most of this. A quick peek over here for some med items. This crate. Try to push. Sometimes these little areas are chock full of stuff, and other times it feels like they're really, really barren. This, however. I've been finding a lot more grizzlies here, which is really nice. Somebody else might be pushing him. It answered my question. I wonder where that guy came from. I wonder if you killed him. Guys killed him. Damn, man. I want to go get that guy I killed.
three man pushing out the back. Pretty dope, not gonna lie. Wait. All right, let's move. We need to grab the poster. Put some scabs. Maybe we try for a long range snipe if those guys are going to hang around. Got this AXMC. That could be kind of fun. Because the mantling there doesn't work. Guys are just eating today, dude. This would have been a great vantage point if I would have had this gun earlier.
Too bad those guys didn't stick around. I'm wondering where Sturman died at here. was taken no that's the way I need to head Get out of here. <laughs> this is a spicy raid. Curious if this guy had friends. Curious if this was the three man team. I don't get that sense though. Pepper Hunter. That's why I like this gun. We had M80s and could run that consistently. This gun is really solid. Might be running my death here, but. Find out. Solo Dolo? Doubt I see this movement here. They'd have to just be on the back side of that. Or moving towards VX. Something died right there, looks like a scab. UPMC. BTR rolling through. Alright, let's go check our guy here.
crispy little one ten. G36 is interesting. I don't see that that often. Question is, do I want some plates? I actually need to stash the gazelle. Damn. I feel like we need to take this. Heavy though, really heavy. Could always drop the rig. Hmm. Bridge VX got taken. I can get to the camp and down to the mark these. I can get to the camp and then over to outskirts in enough time, I think. Excuse me, I ain't mad at taking a stack of A5681, that's for sure. Zulocks are good money, too. Ditch the grenades, take the chain. Need this. At least one of these. What the fuck is going on here?
I feel like I have to take this. Drop our hunter. Uh, that, this, this. All right, this poster. This guy's had a bad day. Must have screwed up whoever shot him though, because did not to loot a whole lot of things from these guys. It was a three man though, so. Three of them died. Only got room for so much loot. Need this fuel conditioner. Poster. Can we check to see if there's a Ledex. Ten minutes. Ledexes get missed here. Doesn't look like it. All right. Get the heck out of here. We made it. All right. Not a bad little raid. That one was a pretty interesting <laughs> woods raid. I feel like we, things kind of popped off there a little bit. We took down two bears, both with headies. And uh, just a couple of scavs with our hunter. Pepper hunter coming in big here. Put some damage in. Not bad, not bad. Making our way towards level 40. All right, loot haul wise, not too bad either. What's interesting is these dog tags. I think these are the, what these are the new, I think EOD dog tags probably makes sense. Yeah. So that's kind of cool. A little bit, something a little bit different. It's neat. Um, we do pick up a gazelle, which is really big because we talked about earlier that uh, we're going to need to go drop those off over on Interchange. Uh, get some of that stuff stored up. So we have still a whole lot here we can do. Um, and that's pretty nice. What I am going to go ahead and do, I'm going to transfer this down. We'll just hang on to this. I do want to get Ref unlocked and get him opened up. Not sure if we'll do that right away here at the outset. Um, so we'll kind of go from there and see but uh this was a, a fun fun little episode here we got we got Sturmund, which is unfortunate oh actually who needs that who needs this thing it's not you is it is it skier peacekeeper Mechanic. Who needs these? Am I losing my mind?
This isn't a daily task for me. I thought it was Ragman. There it is. Duh. Cool. So we do get a little bit more progress there. We are still waiting on getting up to vitality level four. That way we can turn an ambulance, get our last vitality level, knock out a few uh, from that perspective. Let's go ahead and see. Where are we with vitality? Um, Not too bad off. 16 points away. This is a real grind, I feel like, sometimes. But, um, yeah, not bad. We're going to make a good chunk of money here, too. Uh, from quite a few of the things that we're going to end up selling. Probably end up sell this Bastion as well. Uh, just because all three of these should sell quite nicely to the Ragman. Yeah, there's there's an easy 200k and just helmets. So that's pretty solid. Pretty solid. We're doing pretty well from a money standpoint. So happy with that. We have some Bitcoin chilling as well. We should look at doing some hideout progression updates here. So maybe in the next episode, uh, we'll buy a few things. We'll get a couple of things upgraded. One thing that I am thinking about getting running here is the Bitcoin farm, especially now that we have water collector and the booze generator up. This makes sense to be able to run our generator um, and get some get some production off of that. Uh, might not be a bad thing to do. So we'll consider that. A couple of other things that I do want to get installed. Need hideout management to go up. Uh, we can look. We, we've done pretty good here in the hideout. Um, a stash upgrade would be kind of the other next best thing for us to take a look at. We certainly need quite a bit of rubles to be able to do that. Um, so we got to keep grinding from that perspective. Could look at trying to get to level two here, but again, we need stash level three for this. So that is a little bit restrictive. Oh, we could put some weapons on the backside of this. I didn't even I didn't even think about that. Open up a little bit of stash space for us, eh? I do like this Sig Spear. We've been able to cash that in from that previous event. Alright. Oh, look at that. Just like that. We're in business. A little bit more room in the old stash -a Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, it's just barely too big. Just barely. This RPD. Honestly, am I ever going to even probably use that? No. Throw the M4 down here. Get rid of that. I'm going to sell it up. So that's pretty good. I'm going to leave you here. This was a fun one. Um, we're going to rip the plates out of this and then keep this thing ready and rocking and rolling for us to go ahead and, uh, again, get some, uh, get some more task progress. I'm not sure where the next one will take us is, uh, going to be interesting. So we'll have some fun. We'll figure out We've got plenty of tasks to go and do and get some stuff knocked out. So we will go from there, but hopefully you enjoyed. Thanks for being here. Socials, like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for hanging out. Lots more coming. Hardcore action going on as well. So if you're interested in that, we've been pretty consistent with our Wednesday videos, jumping into just some different things. Been focused recently on the new trader. There has been a new update. This uh, was recorded on the new update with the new colliders for armor. Um, so some testing to see what's going on with that and see how that works out. Uh, could be pretty good. More to come. More to follow. We'll be around. Like I said, hit that subscribe button for us. Click on another video. Best way to support the channel. Likes and comments are always appreciated. And we'll close it out here. Thanks for watching. Catch you next one. Peace.